The tall, beautiful sugarcane tree waits in a hot, wet field in southern Vietnam. A farmer will soon come take its delicate sugarcane stalks, and it will begin its journey. After a long trip, the sugarcane's final destination is to turn into delicious and natural sugarcane juice. Because sugar isn't added, sugarcane juice is a healthy, refreshing option in Vietnam. It is a traditional Vietnamese drink that many people enjoy. As the sugarcane gets shoved into the shredder, it is prepared to turn into its delicious sugarcane juice. Other stocks will be added that will make the sugarcane juice too. Five minutes pass and now the fresh juices ice cubes begin to melt as no customers are coming into the shop. Beside the sugarcane juice is a receipt that shows it has become more expensive over the years. Before, sugarcane juice was about 5,000 to 10,000 VND, and now it's around 40,000. But why? Cây mía trồng ở vùng những vùng nông thôn Việt Nam thì đường xá Việt Nam mình chưa có thuận tiện và chưa có được làm rất là phẳng phiêu để mà con di chuyển cho nó nó dễ dàng thì đó là cái về cái giao thông. Next, the sugarcane juice gets slurped down by a customer, like a vacuum cleaner. It starts to sniff the harmful air of awful greenhouse gases. These gases have caused pollution and started to affect the growth of the sugarcane trees in Vietnam. Greenhouse gases are gases that get trapped in the atmosphere, so the atmosphere can't produce clean air. Due to a large number of construction sites, a lot of greenhouse gases are polluting the air and therefore the sustainability of sugarcane farms are in danger. Thay đổi khí hậu, ví dụ như khí hậu mình càng trở nên ô nhiễm thì cái sản lượng cây mía nó cũng sẽ thấp xuống hơn không tốt như ngày xưa nữa. To sustain sugarcane juice, we have to drive cars less reduce factory production, and reduce construction sites. Finally, a new stock gets put into the shredder, and more people start to enter the shop. Not for smoothies, but for sugarcane juice. People must be making good choices. People must be riding bikes and driving cars less. People must be reducing construction sites. As the cycle continues, another delicate sugarcane stock waits for its journey ahead, alive and sustaining Vietnamese culture.